What did you see here, Nick? Uh, let's have a look from waist down. Tiger pulling down. He's choked down. Pete's at a lay down and he just unwinds it. Let's the arms rotate round, gather the ball, keep it going. All good stuff, isn't it? Got to keep yourself turning. Got to picture the shot first and then deliver a follow through to match what you see. Back over to the second, Gary. <laughs> This is a pretty pretty thick lie. We'll take a little bit of a close-up look at it. You can see the raindrops, and watch how he stabilizes that club going through there. The back of the left hand never breaks down. Ball pops up, spinning. Beautifully executed. Just barely needed to carry it about two yards, and that's a, that's a tough thing to do sometimes, Nick, when you've got a, a really thick lie and a delicate shot you have to hit. You need really good forearm and wrist strength. Yeah, it's one of the things that people don't realize. You know, you have to learn to be able to hit the one-yard chip for two years. And we're going to have Pierre Costas take a look at that golf swing of Tiger Woods. With the help of our Konica Minolta BizHub Swing Vision camera, just impeccable with his posture and address as he takes the club back. Halfway back point right there. The club is nicely parallel to the target line. Now this is going to be a knockdown shot, so you're not going to see a huge full shoulder turn out of Tiger like you normally will. Let's watch the cap on his uh, on his head. Just watch the visor looking at the golf ball, looking at the golf ball, still looking at the golf ball. He keeps his head down and back a little bit extra long, trying to hit a knockdown draw. You see the ball starting out to the right and turning over, just a little bit too much of it. When Tiger keeps his head down for that little bit extra long, Gary, he's trying to release the club a little more when he lets the head rotate. Then he's going for the 22 so far today, so we chalk him up for 23. Doesn't take many punts, though, when you're talking about yeah. tap-ins. This is how you strike a wedge, folks. You've got to get the weight on the left foot. You've got to get the ball first, then the divot. Look how still those legs are. Yeah, it's some yeah, well wedges it's sometimes a no, nice feeling to be flat footed, but you still gotta turn your waist through. Still gotta turn your belt buckle to the target. He likes this going spin, spin, back, 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 bite, bite, bite. 